All right, let's take it back to high school where there are some subjects you have to take them and they can be quite complicated. Yeah. Calculus, one of them. Did you have a, uh, a best and worst subject? It, my favorite was not calculus. I don't <laughs> no. think I even remember trying to take that. I don't think I made it that far. <laughs> I blocked that out of my memory. But there is one Round Rock student who's really just an inspiring so many people. He noticed that his classmates, you know, were struggling to pick up some of the concepts when it comes to this. So he wrote his very own calculus textbook. Gake Sands, Blake Devine joining us live in the newsroom. Blake, you got a chance to talk to him. What did he say? Good morning, Sally and Tom. Aditya Villamori is a senior at Round Rock High who spent most of his life moving back and forth between India and the U.S. And back in 2020, he taught himself calculus during the height of the pandemic while living in India. And after acing the AP exam, he put pen to paper, actually publishing a book after seeing students struggle to comprehend calculus over at Round Rock High. Rather than reading an 800-page AP test book, his book squeezed down all of these complicated concepts into 200 pages written from a student's perspective. The senior also started a calculus club where he helps tutor his classmates. Publishing a book is really cool, but I think the most important part of that is the impact it can make to students and really affect them. He took it upon himself to teach himself calculus, and then he wants to share that. He truly has a passion for calculus and for sharing. He wants to help other students. Aditya's book is called The Seven Day Calculus Review, and it's currently available on Amazon Kindle. And as of today, it's actually the top seller on the site for advanced placement test guides. As a senior, he's currently applying to some of the top colleges in the country. His top choice, Cornell University, which is where our very own meteorologist Nick Bannon <laughs> picked up his degree. So cool. Yeah, Nick didn't write the textbook, though. No, he, he didn't. <laughs> um, do you, like, what does he want to do in, in life? What does his future career hold, do you think? I tried to ask him that question. Yeah. He seems like he's kind of like trying to get into a realm of, you know, entrepreneurship, maybe starting a business, coming up with his own invention. He kind of kept that pretty wow. private because he probably wow. has some idea. Yeah, he's yeah. like, going to change the world yeah. and he doesn't want to another patent yeah. right yeah. now, so yeah. I can't go too he's far. He's going to solve the common cold. Is it how yes. he has something like that? That's amazing. Very mm -hmm. impressive. More power to him, too. You know, meteorology is very heavy in the math, so anybody who can uh, not only understand it but can write a book about it yeah I I respect that big time let me